But I wanted to do a quick five, six minute video because we are in self isolation and you know, we all of us are at home. And I thought I would do a video just to discuss um, all the islanders that have actually gone and touched me and thanked me or just communicated with me post their time on the show and you know yeah hey guys it's Murad Murali hope you guys are doing well today if you haven't already click that button for daily and consistent content head over to my Instagram Murad and it's called Murali I don't know why I'm laughing um, subscribe to the channel and subscribe to the podcast please there actually is a lot going on right now in the YouTube stratosphere that I think I might be coming out with another two videos tonight so guys be aware there'll be either another video or another one coming out or two whatever but I wanted to get into this just you know a batch of islanders like around four or five have you know reached out to me and I thought you know I'll let you guys know because obviously I do review this show and of course you guys you know like and dislike characters on the show like me and you guys may be interested to find out who has contacted me and you know whatever whatever now whether they have contacted me or not doesn't really matter for me personally speaking i don't really seek any validation in anybody you know trying to reach out to me to be thankful or hateful or whatever because the only validation i have is within myself so i don't really get rattled or you know or desperate for it in that kind of remark but it also is very nice when islanders do do it anyways so the, this is why I'm laughing, because the first one, you all know. So the, the, the real, low key, the real reason I wanted to make this video is so I can just say you one day babes. That's just the real reason for why I really wanted, these times I want to be doing YouTube for what God willing, maybe the rest of my life and I'm still going to be saying this flipping phrase that I admit that I started, I started saying last year. But low key, of course, you know, you one day babes was the first one, um, one of the first few who really was thankful um, to me. Obviously you saw the videos and stuff and everything and you know, she contacted me actually when she got out of the villa like a week or so, I, was it a week or two afterwards? I don't, I can't really recall whether it was a week or two after, maybe a month after in that kind of range of when she you know ended her time on the show and she's like just to let you know um i'm really i'm thankful for your content when um, i came out of the villa i want we, we don't get our phones straight away so she went on google just to find out what was going on about her and she went on youtube and she saw you know a collection of videos from me screaming her name and support so of course she was thankful so she sent a long, she sent a long message then you know got invited to that in the style event which was nice and then i went to go see um, her and whatever which was also nice as well I mean, so much it's actually like oh i can't thank you enough and then you know she has messaged me in relation to videos that she may like on my channel and stuff like this as well so that is obviously is grateful and appreciative um but at the same time if you one day never really reached out to me i wouldn't be mad at it i wouldn't be irritated at it like i don't as i said i don't do these videos to support people for them to reach out to me or whatever i just do them because i like the way they come across on the tv if they come across as good islanders i'm supporting you that's all it really is for me i'm not really bothered at all or if they don't reach out to me to thank me or whatever for support because it, it really isn't that serious guys it isn't that serious but i'm grateful it's nice for to do so and of course that is the first one on on the list that you guys know the second one on the list um is the winner of love island 2019 miss amber rose gill who has um reached out to me via twitter and reached out to me even on the youtube comments chart saying that she wants to collaborate and do videos so maybe we will in the future you know it is what it is i don't like to force stuff but also it will be nice to do that because i feel like she's a relaxed chilled person um she also has um mentioned me in one of her stories reflecting that I'm one of her favorite YouTubers and she put a list of like five or six and I was one of them again a very nice thing for her to do especially somebody who won the damn show I feel like that in itself was probably the best achievement to have um, I did support Amber on the channel sometimes I did call her out I didn't entirely support it but she I guess she appreciates that I do keep it unbiased um, I don't like to you know just because you like someone doesn't mean that you know right is right wrong is wrong basically and she has commented um, yeah, and stuff and she, she sent a very nice message when I was going through some rough stuff but also um, in on Twitter do you know to say take a break if you guys want if you want to which was a very sweet nice kind thing to do um, so she is also another islander who has re reached out to me as well the third one is um, Anna um, when I went to one of the install events um, her best friend there was a massive fan of my videos which basically means that she has seen everything she knows of the content she whatever 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 um, and this was the time when the show was basically just ended or whatever like a month or so or two after the show ended so they were really really relevant at this time and um you know she was just like yeah i know you i know your videos cool whatever like it wasn't like ott but you know it was it was something that she communicated to me when i was in the same kind of venue when she was in there and you know right now she is working as a pharmacist back in that kind of you know field on the front line to an extent so that in itself is something you have to put your hands up for but she's one of the islanders as well who you know just communicate like here and there the next islander that we have is michael um michael actually came into my dms and a lot of people are saying oh my god he's following you he's following you which is um you know nice appreciative again it doesn't have to follow me i don't really care about it but at the same time it's nice um he sent me a DM along the lines of, um, 
I hope you're keeping well during this period. My brothers let me know the love and support you've showed me during my time in the villa and I can't thank you enough for how you gave me, gave me an unbiased opinion regarding my time in the villa. You champion diverse voices and speak the truth. I pray that your platform grows and become a point of change for many. When this is all over, I would love to have you come to some kind of launch night that I assume that he's planning to have. And you know, which is again, appreciative when, when this Rona ends and if it does, that would be a nice thing. Um, so, you know, he was somebody who has also liked tweets about this and followed and you know, when some they show affirmation in that kind of manner, something that I'm appreciative of, I have supported Michael throughout my time, time in the villa. Um, but again, it doesn't mean that he should thank me for it. It's nice and somebody, it's nice for them to do that, but they don't owe you that. But like, you know what I mean? Like, I feel like, you know, I just do it out of the goodness of my own heart because I like how they come across on TV and I feel like, you know, they have faced trials and tribulations and unjust and I feel like I should use my platform, you know, responsibly when I feel like I definitely should and I feel like, you know, that is very nice. The next person is Leanne. Now, Leanne, um, hasn't really been like, hasn't sent me any private messages or whatever, but she's been liking stuff here and there of my content. Um, and somebody said ages ago, I read a comment, I don't know where I read this now, I can't remember, but somebody said, you know, Leanne reflects in one of her videos when she saw on YouTube that she might have unfollowed YouTubers. And somebody said, well, what if it's Murad and stuff like this? And that wouldn't make any sense because I was the only content creator online who was actually supporting her on YouTube. The, before she even came onto the show, the people were already cussing her out on Twitter and I was, you know, front line supporting the hell out of her, made a whole video dedicated to her and to let, let people know to leave her alone. This was prior to even her journey on the villa. So, but you know, that is other, I guess, is appreciative and liking content here and there on my stuff, which is you know a nice thing for you to do. The next person is Priscilla, who actually also has contacted me personally. Um, she had reflected, you know, thank you so much for your support and, you know, I hope you're doing well with everything given the circumstances of my grandparents and unfortunately what took place there. And she was like, just thank you for your content and how you've just supported um, me and in general. Um, you're amazing, strong, resilient, keep pushing and killing the game. I love your content and I love your consistency. Thank you for all your support, honesty. I do not take any of it for granted. Hopefully we get to meet soon. But that in itself is kind of a given to me because as I've expressed that me and Priscilla have a very good mutual friend, a very close mutual friend. So I already knew that she was good people's when she landed on the show. When my friend told me she was going on the show, I was like, she's good people's and she definitely is, as you guys can clearly tell. And you know, our mutual friend, we're both close to him. So, uh, you know, it, it makes sense. The next person is Biggs. Uh, <laughs> Biggs is coming to my DMs as well. Uh, I think maybe a, a couple of weeks ago or something like this saying, you know, I've seen your content. I respect your hustle, I respect your hard work, I respect your consistency and what you're doing and stuff like this. You know, you being unbiased and you know, whatever, whatever, whatever. And I was like, okay, great, thank you. Like, I appreciate it as well. Like there's so many kind words. Chad is also somebody who it was, a, it was a reference to some video about when he was saying that he wouldn't really have it when it came to Biggs and Rebecca's situation and how he was speaking his opinion on it. And I was like, and he was just laughing in the DM saying the video is funny, whatever, 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 which was nice to do. But those were the batch of Islanders. Uh, I'm pretty sure there may be a couple, but I can't really think off the top of my head right now. But those are just some of the people that I've kind of just jotted down quickly to get this quick video out for you guys. So hopefully you guys can enjoy some content. Hopefully, you know, big up all these people and just everyone in general out from I Love Island who are trying the best. I've seen a lot of them go onto YouTube, which is a great platform to go onto. Um, I don't understand why people are hating or shading them for going on YouTube. Like everybody's in isolation. People can make the most of the time and they're being productive, let them do it, let them have fun with it, and hopefully they'd be a career, and if they, that's what they want, you shouldn't really hate or shade people who are trying to make the most out of their time. You know, I feel like it's really unfair, and I wouldn't like if anybody did it to me when I started on YouTube. So, you know, also think about how you would feel if you were in that position sometimes, and it can be quite impactful when you think about stuff. Let me know your thoughts are when it comes to this video. Let me know what your thoughts are when it comes to this video. I thought I'd hopefully come up with it. Hopefully you guys enjoy this video. It's a bit of a random one. I didn't expect to do it, but I thought, let me just give you guys content 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 so you guys can enjoy 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 subscribe to the channel click that button for daily and consistent content head over to my instagram marat underscore morali and i'll catch you guys soon for another video